Hi and welcome back. If you're new to the channel, my name is Vince. Thanks for stopping by. You're very welcome here indeed. So part of my anti-aging protocol is that I have a blood test taken every three months. And part of that process, I plug my results into an online epigenetic age website. So enough waffling off me. Let's jump into the website and let's look at my epigenetic age taken from my blood test in May 2021. So if you have seen me do this kind of test before, you'll know that I use this company or this website, longevityadvantage.com. Um, very simple to use. Enter your details here into the fields. Uh, click next step and they will send you an email, usually within about a minute, which gives you your results. Uh, I did that, but they didn't send the results. So I tried again, no results. I then tried two other email addresses in case there was a problem now with my email address, no results. So obviously I assumed there was a problem with longevityadvantage.com's website. I gave them 10 days, sent all the results in again using three different email addresses and still no results. So I don't know what's going on with longevityadvantage.com, but they're not playing anymore. So I looked for another site and I came up with, or I came across this one, which is u.share.com. They seem to be slightly more, in fact, a lot more than the previous site um, with regard to what you can do to plan your longevity journey. So I think in future, in the future, I will do a more in-depth video on what this site offers once I learn out, once I learn about exactly what they do actually offer. So let's have a look at my biological age using u.share.com. So the process is quite simple. You set up a free account and then it asks you a quite a long list of questions on things around stress, sleep, steps, fitness, relationships, smoking, blood glucose, blood pressure, cholesterol levels, medications, diet, weight, and alcohol. Uh, and once it's done that, it then generates your epigenetic age. So my last test, which was in March 2021, and that was with longevityadvantage.com, um, looked like this. My chronological age was 56 at the time. Uh, my phenotypic age was 52.84. Uh, that's in years and days and this is what phenotypic age means so that puts me at about three years and a couple of months younger than my then calendar age so the last time I did it which was in May 2021 using u.share.com they say that my age is 52 years and eight months which is four years and seven months younger than my then 57 years and three months calendar age so this is another site I use, and you can use this if you can't get hold of any blood test results. Now this site, I have to admit, has been updated a lot since I started using it about a year ago. Far wider range now um, around lifestyle factors, not as many as u.share.com, um, but far more than when I first started to use it. So this time it came back with me and my epigenetic age at 48. Um, this site is obviously nowhere near as accurate as one that has a blood test algorithm built into it, but definitely a good one if you want to gauge what your epigenetic age is against your calendar age, and if you want something to, to start you on your longevity journey, if you like. Um, that said, you've got here um, very generic health advice, talking about breakfast being the most important meal of the day, and make sure you eat five servings of fruit and vegetables. Uh, the kind of pointless comments you'd get off uh, a new generic uh, YouTube influencer if you like. That's it for biologicalage.com. Well I hope you found that interesting or informative, hopefully both. Um, so if you have had a test done that wanted to know your blood glucose, your blood pressure and your cholesterol level, then why not give this particular website a go? What have you got to lose? Um, if you don't have access to those particular scores, then you can always look at biologicalage.com. But remember, because it is just about the questions, it's important that you answer those questions as honestly as possible. So how much you do smoke, how much you do drink, how much you don't exercise is all key. Um, if you fabricate or you lie on any of the questions, you really are only kidding yourself. Uh, as I said, I'll take a look into sharecare.com in a bit more detail. I'll find out what it has to offer, how we can exploit it, to benefit our longevity journey. Um, once I've got that information, I will make a longer, more dedicated video on this particular website.